Ingersoll General Stores must live on. Someone's fighting for a cause. Or trying to solve a problem. Let's go inside and find out, eh? Who's that? Yes. Something's here. It's signed NS. As in Nathaniel. From whom does he expect a payment and why? This Thomas must be a good friend indeed. Nathaniel is desperate to see him. What a mess. Bathsheba left in a hurry. Anyone home? I'm Red McCraith, the Banisher. Show yourself. I think we're alone. The takings are thin indeed. Wouldn't make me want to stay. Voices from the past. Waiting to be here. Who does Duchess Mock think she is? Taking my wares, taking my business, taking my dignity. To hell with her. To hell with Helen Priest. I'll leg it to Boston before I let her take what's mine. When Helen threatened to take her business, the widow ran away. Prudent. I can't say I blame her. We found all we could. Might be time to go after our thief. Mrs. Ingersoll took a car. Maybe you could follow her tracks? Not a bad idea, Mr. Sather. Not a bad idea at all. Do you think perhaps the late Mr. Ingersoll may haunt his old store? Back to save his wife, and with it his store? Perhaps. I doubt it. Bathsheba must have had motivation to flee in snow like this. Or desperation. Tracks veer to the right. Once you've revealed the routes, I'll destroy the missing cart. Abandoned. The wheel is stuck. The missing cart. Abandoned. The wheel is stuck. Wait a minute, I'm enjoying the target practice. Like you need it. Novices really have no idea how many miles a banisher runs to solve a case. I once met Nero Fox, the infamous banisher who solved all his cases from the comfort of his armchair. I should have become his apprentice. Thing is, his apprentice was the one that went into the field for him. The tracks continue this way. I think Bathsheba was injured. Looks that way. What with the blood and torn clothing and all. The tracks lead into this cave. Must have been really desperate.
Now the past is mine to see. We should find it. Here's the belt. The purse is with it. Keys. Where do Ingersoll's, I don't doubt. I've seen this symbol in the mines below Fort Jericho. Why would she have keys to the mines? Mmm, mines. You want to take a look, don't you? Someone's been here already. Looks like Helen found Mrs. Ingersoll's stash. Oil, sugar, salt. Isn't this Nathaniel Sather's stolen merchandise? Yes, it is. Ledger for Ingersoll's store. Same dates, but with much higher figures. Two different ledgers, one of which was locked inside a chest, 
I think I understand. She stole her own merchandise and hid it in the mines. Then she hid the accounts that would expose her lie. Why would she do that? Helen wanted to take her merchandise. She doesn't want to share, she wants to sell. She's selfish. Nathaniel broke his promise and doesn't regret it. He gave up everything to help people, including his neighborhood. We should go back to him. Traces of a ghost's memory resonate here. Excuse me. Who are you? Hunter's roster. And Theodore Shepard is overdue. May we talk, Mr. Sather? It's time to end this. Nathaniel Sather, you broke a promise to a dying man. The man who gave you everything. It brought the angry ghost of his widow back to haunt you. What's this? What are you doing? Someone has to pay the piper. May as well be you. Bill. Is this a treasure map? It's badly faded, but I see a word. Curse. A cursed treasure map, or at least a map to cursed treasure. A map which we will, of course, be following. Well, I do love a treasure hunt. 